My name is Dina Barus. I am a senior research associate at International Potato Center in Nairobi. Coming from a farming community, I would really love to see farmers doing well, getting better yields, that means better income, and that means they can have a better livelihood with their family. In Kenya, potato is produced by so many farmers, about a million, and it's produced in so many counties, actually over 20 out of 47 counties, and there are so many challenges. When farmers are not able to access quality seed, they end up buying seed from the market, which is full of pests and diseases, or they recycle their own seed. Usually the seed they recycle are not good quality because they sell the best. And when they do that, the yields are very, very low. And also there's a lot of pests and diseases in their farms which spread to the other farms. And low yields means low income. Traditionally, production of seed in the country, they would use production of mini tuber as a starter material and they would do three to four field generation before seed is available to the farmers. International Potato Centre, in partnership with the county government and other partners, we are able to support farmers through training, our capacity building when it comes to technologies, but we also introduce seed technologies uh, like apical rooted cutting to complement the existing seed production system. Apical rooted cutting is similar to a vegetable seedling and so farmers can easily handle them. Kuzalisa mbegu na iyo cuttings inasaindia sana kwa kuwa cutting moja ukipanda inapata tubers kiango ya kutoka kumi and isirin. Kwa hivyo iyo kujalisa iyo mbegu inakuwa na umuimu sana na inakuwa ni mbegu wa ina magonjwa. The apical rooted cuttings that farmers use to produce seed all come from the mother plant. A mother plant is a plant produced under sterile condition in the greenhouses and is produced from in vitro plantlets. Potato farmers have benefited from apical rooted cutting technology in that they can access high quality starter material and that translates to better yields. Through apical rooted cutting technology, it's been possible to introduce new improved varieties which are pest and disease resistant, they are high yielding, and they are also good at processing. Kuna Asanti, Sangi, Kojo, na Unica. Napenda Unica kwa sababu mazao ya Unica ni mingi na ata kutumia inaka kwa munda vira kuota na ata inaka kwa munda for creating awareness on apical rooted cuttings, we partner with the county government who will take a lead in training of farmers through extension officers who ensure that farmers who receive the cuttings follow good agricultural practices. To improve the current seed potato system in the country, public-private partnership plays a key role. So currently we have Stockman Rosen in Naivasha, which has invested in infrastructure and facilities and they can be able to produce cutting in large numbers. We were prompted to get into producing rooted apical cuttings of potatoes to play a role in food security. So we're actually producing rooted apical cuttings to try and fill the gap in the industry in terms of clean seed availability in the country. Since we started the production of rooted apical cuttings, we have seen a growth of almost five-fold in terms of uptake of technology, and we've seen farmers from all over the country ordering rooted apical cuttings to produce their own clean seed. Napenda kutumia cuttings kwa sababu ina masao mengi ya hali ya juu na nikiakisa napata kwa njia haraka. Wakulima wa cooperative wensangu pia wamejaribu kupanda cuttings na wamefurahi I'm really really excited to see farmers like Sesinta progressing adopting technologies and that these technologies are improving her life and also improving the neighboring community through access to quality seed